Hi Gemini and welcome to your daily tarot advice. This will be for the week of December 10th through December 16th, 2018. I'm going to start by pulling a card for your overall energy and then I will pull a card for each day this week. So Gemini, let's see what is up for you guys. Okay, so we have You Are Good Enough, Full Moon in Virgo. Gemini, this is a week where we are not to put our needs and our desires in the back seat for anybody. This is a week where you need to hear your inner voice and where you need to tell yourself that your needs and your happiness matter and they do count, okay? Um, a lot of, I'm feeling a lot of mothers uh, for some reason where it's... Like you, you're being so far extended, like just trying to do it all, keep it all together, and um, you're not feeling loved and appreciated and, and noticed. It's like I'm taken for granted and I'm tired of it. I'm giving my all. I'm giving my all. And it's just nobody cares. And this is spirit saying, Gemini, I see you and I care and I appreciate you. Don't stop doing what you're doing. You are working for me, and you know, sometimes that is enough, and sometimes it's not enough, right? But Spirit wants you to know this week that you are so needed, and you are so loved, and you are worthy. If somebody has rejected you or put you down, really just ripped you apart, your character, who you are, and it's made you feel very small, Gemini wash away that energy. It is not true whatsoever, okay? You you are perfect as you are. You're beautiful as you are. What you do, what you give is good enough. When you're putting yourself to capacity and you know you can do no more than you have done, feel good about yourself. Even if somebody else is like, oh, that's it, it, it. who cares about them? You know you did your best. Spirit knows you did your best. And that's all that matters at the end of the day. Energy is energy. And all that will eventually come back to you, Gemini. And you'll see that you are not so bad. Or, you know, that you do deserve love and admiration and appreciation and respect for all that you do. So, let's pull a card for each day and see how your week is going to unfold. All right, Monday, we have a barrier. So Monday is not a day to expect things, I feel, to go as planned or to get things all done that you are hoping to complete. This could be where, you know, uh, if you work in an office, you have like this to-do list for today and uh, yeah, none of it really gets done. It's like you're pulled in a lot of different directions. You have to put a lot of different fires out. Um, others of you, it's like you've really been wanting something or, or you're really pushing towards something. And it's like no matter what, no matter what, it's like there's this barrier for you. And that might be what's making you feel kind of small or not so good about yourself. And, you know, whatever's blocking you, just... For Monday, don't let it bother you and, and, you know, eat you up inside. Just say, you know what, what's meant for me will always find its way to me. If I can't walk through this door right now, there's a reason for that. And I, the, the more I calm down and accept things as they are right now, the more I'll understand why I can't get through this door just yet. All right. And so look at this. Tuesday, we have the winter card. Um... You know, Gemini, with that, I really feel that you are going to give somebody the deep freeze. I swear it. I don't feel like this has anything to do with the actual season of winter. Um, not past or about to come. This is like giving somebody the deep freeze or we need to give somebody the deep freeze or whatever we're being blocked from, we need to recognize that right now this is in the season of winter, which means it's a time for hibernation. It's a time for reflection. It's a time for stillness and regeneration. Okay. So if we're being blocked, that's why Gemini, because right now 
We're in the phase, the season of winter, for whatever that situation is. And what comes after winter is spring. So there is going to be change. You will eventually walk through this door, but it will not happen until this um, situation is out of its season of winter, okay? And also, yeah, you, I think, are giving somebody the deep freeze on Tuesday. Wednesday, look at this. We have pause. So... Wednesday is a day of reflection and of rest. Um, some of you might choose to work from home or call in to work altogether, or it may be your day off naturally, but it's a day of rest, of relaxation, of, you know, not doing too many things. Um, some of you, it might be that you need to recharge your batteries, okay? If you're just feeling really kind of run down Wednesday, Take some time to love yourself, to nurture yourself, to be sweet and kind to yourself, you know? How would you help another person who has been running on all cylinders, giving everything they can to everybody that they know, not feeling appreciated, not feeling loved? How would you respond to them? What would you do for them? What would you say to them? Those are the very things you need to do and say to yourself. Also. Um, it's like we need, really, we need to take a break and rejuvenate ourselves on Wednesday. Thursday, we have deception. Um, Gemini, I, somebody, somebody may not be um, tried and true, and that might be who we're deep freezing. Maybe even like we're blocking them, we're deep freezing, we're trying to ghost them, like we're trying to get some energy out of our life, but it's like it keeps slipping back in somehow, some way, okay? And uh, it's sneaky energy, Gemini Thursday. There's some sneaky energy about, and you know, trust your gut. If you feel like something's off or you feel like somebody's being a little bit scandalous or shady, Chances are that, that they are exactly what you're feeling inside. So trust yourself, regardless of, you know, what you feel or think about them. Nice. Friday, fresh start. So we have winter and now here's spring. Okay, Gemini, Friday, it's like things are better. Um, whatever we're dealing with um, throughout the week, Friday, it's like, ah. Oh, Thank you, Jesus. Thank God, you know. Um, there's something being offered to you. There's some new help. There's uh, maybe even an apology. If you've put the deep freeze on somebody because you're tired of, of their crap, like here, it's Friday, here they are saying, okay, I'm sorry, you know, um, I wave my white flag. Do you forgive me? On Saturday, we have fear. So let's pull Sunday. And then Sunday, we have the Divine Feminine. Okay. So whatever this fresh start is, by Saturday, we're feeling a little bit nervous and unsure about it. But then by Sunday, we're feeling good. So listen, Gemini, the first part of the week might be a little bit challenging and intense and heavy. But the second half of the week, it's really going to change. And the energy is going to lighten and you're going to feel much better, feel more optimistic. I feel like some of you are receiving some apologies and it's like you put somebody on deep freeze. I just, that's all I keep thinking and feeling and I just, so let's pull some advice. All right, something is not quite right. <laughs> Uh, well, you know, we see that right here at the center of the reading, right? I say, trust your intuition. So, it says, beware that something deceitful may hide behind a mask. Beware as well that some unpleasant energy may attach itself to your surrounding. Declutter and detox. Sever your connection to negative influences. Seek help. So, Gemini, yeah, right here. Something is not quite right. And that might be why you need to put somebody on deep freeze or kind of put a situation on ice for a minute so that you can really assess it from a different perspective, from a different angle. And, you know, you might decide, you know what, I'm completely done. I'm tired. I'm over this. You know, whatever the situation is for you personally. And that might be what this fresh start is about right here. 
but then Saturday you're kind of second guessing yourself but by Sunday you know Gemini you know it's all good and you made the right choice okay so whoever needs to be like cut out of your life let go of it might be the week to do that um, because it's almost like you're spinning your wheels you're not getting anywhere also if somebody's put you on deep freeze and all of a sudden they show back up in your life offering you a fresh start Gemini you probably do not want to trust that okay you don't with this right here as your advice you probably don't want to trust it they have an ulterior motive all right so let's pull an outcome card All right, so this is all about um, celebration and the happiness coming together, a new opportunity. Yes, Gemini, shed whatever blocks you or what makes you spin your wheels. It's time to like let it all go. And if something that is just like totally ghosted you, blocked you, put you on ice is trying to come back into your world this week, think twice because they definitely have an ulterior motive Gemini I don't feel like they are being honest it's like they want something from you and you will feel the vibes okay and last time around they left you feeling like you weren't good enough and you are good enough um, if this is about it like your job being in the workplace open yourself up to um, new jobs job interviews job opportunities this week Gemini it looks very lucrative where you can get yourself out of that situation that's making you feel you know small and little about yourself so Gemini it's gonna it's gonna end well the week ends well even if there's some turbulence at the beginning okay um, so those are your messages for the week and before I end the video I just want to give a shout out to my friend Heather's uh, blog talk radio show that she does every Tuesday evening 5 central 8 eastern and she will talk about a spiritual topic and then she opens the phone lines to many free readings I highly highly recommend you check out her show and just you know see for yourself how amazing she is through the free readings or you know call in yourself to get one if you do need a reading um, I recommend booking one with her a hundred percent she recently gave me a reading and um, she knocked my socks off okay she is an amazing medium she is the real deal uh, just have one session with her and you will see it for yourself and I only am recommending this if you truly need some guidance Gemini she will help you um, especially in matters of passed on loved ones so Gemini those are your messages for the week I'm wishing you all the very best take care